Chapter 1. The Foundation of Inner Transformation Welcome to As Within, So Without. How Inner Change Multiplies Your Success This book is dedicated to guiding you through a profound journey of self-discovery and personal growth, aimed at amplifying your success by focusing on the essential aspect of any transformation, the inner self. The Mirror of Your Inner World your external reality is a reflection of your inner world. This simple yet profound truth is often overlooked in the pursuit of success. How you perceive yourself, think, and feel fundamentally shapes your experiences and outcomes. This chapter explores the foundational principles of aligning your inner world with the outer world to achieve greater success. Understanding the Inner-Outer Connection The principle of as within, so without stems from ancient wisdom suggesting that the state of your inner consciousness directly influences your external circumstances. It's not just about positive thinking, but about genuine internal change. To change your reality, you first need to change your inner attitudes, beliefs, and emotions. Self-awareness, the starting point. Self-awareness is the key to beginning this transformation. It involves understanding your thoughts, feelings, motivations, and their origins. It requires you to be honest with yourself, to recognize your strengths, and acknowledge areas where you need growth. Tools for Enhancing Self-Awareness Journaling Writing down your thoughts and feelings can help you understand patterns and triggers in your life. Mindfulness Meditation Regular practice helps in observing your thoughts and feelings without judgment, leading to deeper self-awareness. Feedback from Others Constructive feedback can provide external perspectives on your behavior and how it aligns with your inner intentions. Beliefs and Mindsets Your beliefs are the core scripts of your life's play. They dictate your thoughts, which in turn, shape your actions. To change your outcomes, start by examining and altering these core beliefs. Shifting from fixed to growth mindset. Fixed mindset. Believing that your abilities, intelligence, and talents are fixed traits. Growth Mindset Believing that you can develop abilities through dedication and hard work. Adopting a growth mindset enables you to embrace challenges, persist in the face of setbacks, and view effort as the path to mastery. It opens you to new experiences and growth, leading to success. Emotional Intelligence Emotional Intelligence, EQ is the ability to understand, use, and manage your emotions in positive ways to relieve stress, communicate effectively, empathize with others, overcome challenges, and diffuse conflict. High EQ leads to better relationships and success. Developing emotional intelligence. Self-regulation. Manage your emotions healthily and constructively. Empathy. Understand and share the feelings of others. Social skills. Interact well with others. Maintaining good relationships. Setting the stage for transformation. The journey to success is not just about achieving goals, but transforming oneself to be prepared for those goals. As you increase your self awareness, shift your mindset, and enhance your emotional intelligence, you lay the foundation for lasting change that will not only impact your personal life, but also multiply your professional success. Chapter 2 Harnessing the Power of Habits. In the realm of personal and professional development, the power of habits cannot be overstated. Your daily habits are the architecture of your life, constructing the reality you live in moment by moment. Mastery over your habits means mastery over your outcomes. The Science of Habit Formation Habits are the brain's way of saving energy. By automating frequent actions, the brain reduces the mental load, allowing you to focus on more complex tasks. Every habit you form is rooted in a simple loop. Cue, routine, and reward. Understanding this loop is the first step to transforming ineffective habits into powerful tools for success. Breaking Old Habits To change an existing habit, start by identifying the cue that triggers it. This could be a time, a place, an emotional state, or the actions of other people. Once you recognize the cue, you can change the routine that follows. Instead of reaching for a snack when stressed, routine, take a brisk walk or practice deep breathing. The reward, relief from stress, remains the same, but the path to achieving it becomes healthier and more productive. Building New Habits When establishing a new habit, 
Make the cue obvious and the reward satisfying. For instance, if you aim to read more books, leave a book on your nightstand where you'll see it before bedtime. After reading, give yourself a small treat, a favorite piece of chocolate, for example. This positive reinforcement helps solidify the new habit. Prioritizing high-impact habits. Focus on habits that have a compound effect on your success. These are the behaviors that, when practiced consistently, yield exponential rewards. Consistent morning routines. How you start your day often sets the tone for the rest of it. A solid morning routine might include meditation, exercise, and a healthy breakfast. This routine doesn't just prepare you physically, but it aligns your mental state to tackle the day's challenges effectively. Lifelong learning. The habit of continuous learning is indispensable in today's fast-paced world. Dedicate time daily or weekly to acquire new knowledge or skills. This could be through reading, online courses, or engaging in discussions with mentors and peers. Time management. Effective time management is a cornerstone habit for success. Use tools like the Eisenhower Box to prioritize tasks based on urgency and importance. This method helps you focus on what truly matters, reducing wasted time and increasing productivity. Emotional Habits Your emotional responses are also habitual. Cultivating habits of gratitude, positivity, and resilience can significantly affect your emotional well-being and interpersonal relationships. Practicing Gratitude Start or end your day by listing three things you're grateful for. This habit shifts your focus from what's missing or problematic to what's abundant and right in your life, enhancing overall happiness and satisfaction. Cultivating Positivity Surround yourself with positive influences and make a habit of seeking the good in situations. This doesn't mean ignoring problems, but rather approaching them from a place of solution and opportunity rather than defeat. Building Resilience Resilience is about bouncing back from setbacks. Develop this by facing small challenges head-on and learning from them. This habit strengthens your ability to cope with bigger adversities. By understanding the mechanics of habit formation and focusing on these key high-impact habits, you empower yourself to build a life of greater success and fulfillment. Remember, excellence is not an act, but a habit. By choosing your habits wisely, you shape the future you desire. Chapter 3. Mastering Your Thoughts for Peak Performance Your thoughts are the architects of your destiny. Each thought acts as a brushstroke on the canvas of your life. To harness your true potential and achieve your highest levels of success, it's essential to master the art of controlling and directing your thoughts. The Power of Positive Thinking Positive thinking isn't just about expecting the best to happen. It's about accepting that whatever happens is the best for that moment. This mindset shifts your focus from worrying about what might go wrong to exploring what is going right, thus opening your mind to opportunities and solutions that pessimism would have obscured. Reframing Negative Thoughts Reframing involves altering negative thought patterns by challenging the assumptions behind them. When faced with a challenging situation, instead of thinking, this is impossible, ask yourself, what can I learn from this? Or, how can I make this work? This approach not only shifts your mental state, but also your emotional response, paving the way for more constructive actions. Visualization Techniques Visualization is a powerful tool for focusing your mind and manifesting your goals. By creating a vivid mental image of achieving your goals, you engage your subconscious mind, strengthen your motivation, and enhance your confidence. Spend a few minutes each day visualizing yourself succeeding in your endeavors, feeling the success as if it has already been achieved. Cognitive Restructuring for Success Cognitive restructuring is a technique used in cognitive behavioral therapy to help individuals challenge and change irrational or maladaptive thoughts. By identifying harmful thought patterns, you can systematically dismantle them and replace them with more adaptive, helpful thoughts that propel you toward your goals. Identifying Cognitive Distortions Common cognitive distortions include all-or-nothing thinking, overgeneralization, and catastrophizing. Recognize when you're using these patterns and actively challenge them. For instance, if you tend to think, I never do anything right, examine this belief by recalling instances when you have succeeded. 
The Role of Affirmations Affirmations are positive, empowering statements that, when repeated often, reinforce positive thinking and self-belief. Craft affirmations that resonate with your goals and values. For example, I am capable of achieving great things, or I handle my challenges with grace and wisdom. Repeat these daily to cultivate a mindset geared towards success. Managing Mental Clutter A cluttered mind leads to a disorganized life. Managing mental clutter involves organizing your thoughts and focusing on what truly matters. Prioritizing Tasks Use tools like mind mapping to visualize and organize your thoughts and tasks. This not only clears your mental space, but also helps you focus on completing tasks effectively. Digital Detox In a world where digital distractions are ubiquitous, taking regular breaks from digital devices can help clear your mind, reduce stress, and improve concentration. Mindfulness Practices Mindfulness practices such as deep breathing, yoga, or meditation can greatly enhance your mental clarity. They help you maintain a moment-to-moment -moment awareness, which is crucial for managing stress and enhancing overall cognitive function. By mastering your thoughts through these strategies, you set a strong foundation for personal and professional success. Each thought you cultivate and nurture shapes the trajectory of your life. The mastery of your mind is not an overnight feat, but a continuous process that involves dedication, practice, and persistence. As you work on controlling and optimizing your thoughts, you'll find that your actions and outcomes will naturally follow suit, leading to a life of success and fulfillment. Chapter 4. Cultivating Emotional Resilience for Sustainable Success Emotional resilience is your ability to bounce back from setbacks and maintain your inner peace amidst chaos. It's a critical skill for anyone aiming to thrive in today's fast-paced and often unpredictable world. Building this resilience ensures that you remain focused and efficient, no matter what life throws your way. Understanding Emotional Resilience Emotional resilience is not about avoiding feelings or hardships. It's about navigating through them with grace and coming out stronger. This resilience is what allows you to encounter failure and yet keep moving forward with an undiminished enthusiasm toward your goals. Embrace Vulnerability Embracing vulnerability is a strength, not a weakness. Acknowledging and expressing your emotions openly leads to greater connection with others and a deeper understanding of yourself, which in turn bolsters resilience. It means seeing the value in all experiences, even failures, as each provides unique lessons and opportunities for growth. The Role of Emotional Agility Emotional agility is the ability to manage your thoughts and feelings in a way that drives you forward. It involves being flexible with your emotions based on the demands of your environment, thereby turning emotional obstacles into stepping stones for success. Techniques for Developing Emotional Resilience Developing emotional resilience can be approached through several practical techniques that strengthen your ability to handle stress and recover from adversities. Regular Emotional Check-Ins Take time each day to reflect on your emotional state. Ask yourself how you're feeling and why. This practice helps you become more attuned to your emotional triggers and prepares you to handle them better. Stress Reduction Techniques Techniques such as deep breathing exercises, progressive muscle relaxation, or even simple activities like walking or listening to music can significantly reduce stress levels and enhance your emotional resilience. Cognitive Reframing This involves changing your frame of reference to view stressful situations from a more positive or opportunity-focused viewpoint. Instead of seeing a problem as a roadblock, view it as a challenge to overcome or a chance to learn. Building Emotional Endurance Just like physical stamina, emotional endurance can be developed with practice and patience. The more you work on it, the more resilient you become. Incremental Exposure Gradually expose yourself to the types of situations that might unsettle you, but do so in a controlled and manageable way. This exposure helps build your tolerance and reduces anxiety over time. Develop a Support Network Having a robust support network can greatly enhance your resilience. Knowing you have people who can provide emotional support and practical advice can make facing challenges less daunting. Positive Social Connections 
Cultivate relationships with people who are positive and supportive. Positive social interactions can boost your mood and provide a buffer against stress. Leveraging emotional insights. Use emotional insights gained through self-reflection to guide your decision-making process. Understanding your emotions enhances your leadership skills, allowing you to better motivate others and inspire confidence. Emotional forecasting. Learn to anticipate how certain decisions will make you feel and how they will affect those around you. This foresight can help you avoid unnecessary stress and conflict. Leading with emotional intelligence. Lead by example. Show empathy, listen actively, and respond thoughtfully. These qualities ensure that you not only manage your own emotions well, but also positively influence the emotional climate of your entire team or organization. By cultivating emotional resilience, you equip yourself to handle the complexities of life and leadership. It allows you to face up to and navigate through difficulties with composure and determination, ensuring that each step you take is steady and sure, even in uncertain times. Chapter 5. The Art of Communicating Your Vision Effective communication is the bridge between confusion and clarity. To achieve great success, you must not only have a clear vision, but also the ability to convey this vision compellingly and persuasively to others. The importance of clear communication. Clarity in communication prevents misunderstandings and aligns your team with your goals. It is essential not just for leaders, but for anyone who aims to make an impact. Clear, confident communication conveys authority and helps to build trust among your peers, clients, and stakeholders. Simplify your message. The simpler your message, the more powerful it becomes. Use plain language and avoid jargon that might confuse your audience. This makes your message accessible to a broader audience, ensuring it resonates more deeply. Be concise but comprehensive. While simplicity is key, your messages must also contain all necessary information to avoid ambiguity. Striking a balance between brevity and thoroughness ensures that your communication is both efficient and effective. Techniques for effective communication. Developing your communication skills involves several strategic techniques that can enhance how your message is received and understood. Active listening. Active listening involves fully concentrating on the speaker, understanding their message, providing feedback, and remembering what is being said. This practice not only improves your ability to absorb information, but also shows respect for the speaker, fostering a more open and honest dialogue. Emotional Tone The emotional tone of your communication is just as important as the words themselves. It can set the mood and influence the receptiveness of your audience. Be aware of your emotions and how they affect your tone and body language. Body Language Nonverbal cues often speak louder than words. Maintaining eye contact, using open gestures, and mirroring the body language of your listener can greatly enhance the connection and understanding between you and your audience. Mastering Persuasive Communication To move people to action, you need to master the art of persuasion. This means crafting your messages to appeal to their interests, desires, and values. Know your audience. Understanding your audience's needs, values, and possible objections enables you to tailor your message in a way that appeals to them directly. This alignment increases the persuasive power of your communication. Use stories and analogies. People resonate with stories and analogies more than with abstract concepts. Using them in your communication makes your message more relatable and memorable. Share personal stories or relevant case studies that illustrate your points and bring your message to life. Call to Action Always conclude your communications with a clear call to action. Tell your audience exactly what you want them to do next. This directive should be direct and easy to understand, removing any guesswork about the next steps. Enhancing Interpersonal Communication Successful leaders know that their ability to communicate well one-on-one -on -one is just as important as their public speaking skills. Tailor Your Message When speaking directly to someone, tailor your message to reflect their individual concerns and interests. This personal touch can make your communication more impactful and meaningful. Practice empathy. Empathy can transform your communication by helping you to see things from the other person's perspective. 
It allows you to address concerns more effectively and forge stronger connections, enhancing collaborative efforts. Feedback loops. Create mechanisms for feedback in all communications. This could be as simple as asking for opinions or as formal as a survey. Feedback not only informs you about the effectiveness of your communication, but also engages your audience, making them feel valued and heard. By mastering the art of communication, you amplify your ability to lead and inspire others. Whether it's speaking to a large audience or engaging in one-on-one -on -one conversations, effective communication skills are essential tools that can propel you and your vision forward. Chapter 6. Strategic Goal Setting for Maximum Impact Setting goals is not merely about defining what you want to achieve, but also structuring your aspirations in a way that maximizes your potential for success. Strategic goal setting transforms aspirations into actionable paths that lead to accomplishment and fulfillment. Understanding the Hierarchy of Goals Goals are often best structured in a hierarchical manner, starting from your ultimate vision and breaking down into smaller, manageable tasks. This approach ensures that each step you take is aligned with a larger purpose, providing motivation and a clear roadmap to follow. Set long-term visions. Begin by defining your long-term vision. What do you want to achieve in the next five to 10 years? These goals should be ambitious and reflect your deepest aspirations. They serve as the guiding star for all your planning. Break down into medium-term objectives. From your long-term vision, derive medium-term objectives. These are typically goals you aim to achieve within the next one to three years. They are more specific than your vision, but still broad enough to allow for flexibility and adaptation. Establish short-term goals. Finally, break your medium-term objectives into short-term goals. These should be actionable and achievable within the next few months to a year. Short-term goals are your immediate focus and should be designed to be smart, specific, measurable, achievable, relevant, and time-bound. The Power of Writing Your Goals Down The act of writing down your goals cannot be overstated. It translates your thoughts into a tangible form, making them clearer and more real. Written goals are constant reminders of what you need to accomplish, serving both as a motivator and a tool for reflection. Regular review and adjustment goals are not set in stone. As you progress, regularly review and adjust your goals to reflect your current circumstances and the lessons you've learned along the way. This flexibility helps you stay relevant and responsive to change, ensuring sustained progress. Leveraging milestones for motivation. Milestones are key markers of progress in the pursuit of your goals. They provide opportunities to celebrate achievements along your path, keeping your motivation high, and providing a sense of accomplishment. Set clear milestones. Define clear milestones for each of your short-term goals. These should be significant enough to feel like achievements, but frequent enough to keep you engaged. Celebrating these milestones will boost your confidence and reinforce your commitment to your larger vision. Reflect on achievements. Take time to reflect on each milestone. What worked well? What could be improved? Reflection not only provides valuable insights, but also deepens your understanding of your own capabilities and growth. Prioritizing tasks and time management. Effective goal achievement requires excellent time management. Prioritizing tasks according to their impact and urgency ensures that you are always working on what matters most. The Eisenhower Box Utilize the Eisenhower Box to categorize tasks into four quadrants based on their urgency and importance. Focus your energy primarily on tasks that are both urgent and important, but do not neglect those that are important but not urgent as these contribute significantly to your long-term success. Daily Planning Start each day with a clear plan of what you need to achieve. Align your daily tasks with your short-term goals and ensure that every action contributes towards advancing your milestones. Cultivating Accountability Accountability plays a critical role in achieving goals. Whether through a mentor, a coach, or a peer group, Having someone to hold you accountable can significantly enhance your focus and perseverance. Share your goals. Share your goals with someone you trust and respect. This adds a layer of commitment, 
and can motivate you to follow through. Choose someone who is supportive, yet willing to challenge you to push your boundaries. Regular accountability meetings. Set up regular check-ins with your accountability partner. These meetings are opportunities to assess your progress, discuss challenges, and adjust your strategies as necessary. By strategically setting and pursuing well-defined goals, you create a framework that directs your actions and decisions towards meaningful success. Remember, goal setting is not just about reaching your destination, but about optimizing the path to get there, ensuring that each step you take is purposeful and impactful. Chapter 7. Nurturing a Mindset of Abundance Embracing an abundance mindset is crucial for transcending limitations and achieving extraordinary success. This mindset shifts your focus from scarcity, where opportunities seem limited, to abundance, where possibilities are viewed as plentiful. It cultivates a generous spirit and an expansive approach to life that attracts prosperity and success. The concept of scarcity versus abundance. The scarcity mindset is characterized by feelings of jealousy, fear, and competition, driving the belief that more for others means less for you. In contrast, an abundance mindset thrives on mutual growth and success, fostering collaboration, and believing that there is enough success to go around. Recognizing scarcity triggers. Identify what triggers your scarcity thinking. It could be related to money, resources, or opportunities. Understanding these triggers allows you to consciously shift your perspective during times of stress or uncertainty. Cultivating Generosity Generosity is a key component of the abundance mindset. By giving more, whether it's time, resources, or knowledge, you reinforce the belief that you have more than enough, which in turn perpetuates feelings of abundance. Practical Steps to Develop an Abundance Mindset Developing an abundance mindset involves intentional practice and reflection. Here are some strategies to cultivate this transformative way of thinking. Practice gratitude. Gratitude magnifies positive emotions and shifts your focus from what's lacking to what's plentiful. Start and end each day by listing three things you are grateful for. This simple practice can dramatically shift your perspective and foster a sense of abundance. Focus on possibilities. Whenever you face a challenge, Train yourself to look for opportunities within it. Ask questions like, what can I learn here? Or, how can this enhance my growth? This shifts your mindset from seeing obstacles to recognizing opportunities. Expand your influence networking. And expanding your circle of influence can reinforce your abundance mindset. Surround yourself with people who embody the abundance mentality, and you'll find their outlooks and habits influencing your own. Abundance in Action Leading with abundance. Leading with an abundance mindset can significantly influence your professional environment, promoting a culture of creativity and innovation. Here's how you can lead by example. Encourage team development. Invest in the growth and development of your team. Encouraging continuous learning and skill development communicates trust and a belief in abundance, which can inspire your team to reach higher levels of achievement. Promote a culture of sharing foster. A work environment where sharing knowledge is the norm. When team members feel encouraged to share their insights and resources, it reduces competition and builds a supportive team dynamic. Reward Innovation Recognize and reward creativity and new ideas. This not only motivates your team but also promotes a sense of psychological safety and openness, essential for fostering an abundant and innovative workplace. Addressing and Overcoming Limiting Beliefs Limiting beliefs are often the greatest barriers to developing an abundance mindset. They can stem from past experiences, societal conditioning, or negative self-talk. Identify and challenge. Limiting beliefs. Be vigilant about recognizing your limiting beliefs. Challenge them by asking yourself whether they are truly based on facts or just assumptions. Replace them with empowering beliefs that support your goals and aspirations. Visualization Techniques Use visualization to reinforce your new, abundant beliefs. Imagine yourself succeeding and experiencing abundance in all areas of your life. This mental practice helps solidify the belief in your ability to manifest and attract more success. By nurturing an abundance mindset, 
you not only enhance your own capacity for success, but also contribute to a more positive and prosperous environment around you. Remember, an abundance mindset isn't about having more, but about being more. It's a paradigm that transforms how you perceive and interact with the world, leading to limitless possibilities and unprecedented success. Chapter 8. Mastering the Art of Adaptation In an ever-changing world, the ability to adapt is crucial for sustained success and growth. Those who master the art of adaptation can navigate the uncertainties of life and business with agility and confidence, turning potential threats into opportunities for innovation and advancement. The Importance of Being Adaptable Adaptability is the skill that enables you to respond effectively to change, a critical ability in today's fast-paced world. It involves being open to new ideas, willing to learn new skills, and ready to adjust strategies as situations evolve. Embrace change as a constant. The first step in becoming more adaptable is to accept change as a constant reality. Instead of resisting change, welcome it as an opportunity to grow and learn. By embracing change, you reduce anxiety and increase your capacity to handle new challenges. Stay informed. Keeping abreast of industry trends, technological advancements, and market shifts is vital. By staying informed, you can anticipate changes and adapt your strategies accordingly, keeping you ahead of the curve. Developing Adaptive Skills To cultivate adaptability, focus on developing skills that allow you to pivot quickly and effectively when necessary. Critical Thinking Critical thinking allows you to objectively evaluate information and alternatives, leading to better decision-making under pressure. Strengthen your critical thinking by challenging your assumptions, and considering multiple perspectives. Creative problem-solving creativity is key to adaptability. When faced with challenges, try to think outside the box and come up with innovative solutions. Encourage brainstorming sessions and don't be afraid to take calculated risks. Learning agility. Learning agility is your ability to learn quickly and apply knowledge in diverse situations. Continuously seek new knowledge, skills, and experiences that push you out of your comfort zone and expand your capabilities. Implementing Adaptive Strategies in Leadership Adaptive leadership is about guiding others through unknowns and inspiring them to embrace change. Here are some strategies to enhance your leadership adaptability. Foster a flexible environment. Create a culture that encourages flexibility and experimentation. Allow team members to try new methods and ideas without fear of failure. This environment supports growth and adaptation, both at the individual and organizational levels. Communicate transparently. Transparent communication is essential during times of change. Keep your team informed about developments and the reasons behind decisions. This openness builds trust and makes it easier for everyone to buy into new directions. Lead by example. Demonstrate adaptability in your own actions. When your team sees you responding constructively to change, they are more likely to emulate this behavior. Show resilience in the face of setbacks and remain committed to continual improvement. Leveraging technology for adaptation. In the digital age, technology plays a crucial role in enhancing adaptability. Leveraging the right technologies can provide the tools and data needed to make swift decisions. Utilize data analytics. Data analytics can offer insights that help predict trends and prepare for changes. Use these tools to gather relevant data and make informed decisions quickly. Embrace automation. Automation can free up time and resources, allowing you and your team to focus on more strategic tasks. Identify repetitive tasks that can be automated to improve efficiency and adaptability. Continuous learning platforms. Invest in learning platforms that provide ongoing education and training in your field. These resources ensure that you and your team remain knowledgeable and capable, no matter how your industry evolves. Mastering the art of adaptation is not merely a survival skill, but a pathway to thriving in any environment. By developing adaptability, you ensure that you remain relevant, resilient, and ready to seize new opportunities as they arise. This ability to pivot and embrace change is what distinguishes true leaders from mere followers, enabling them to lead their teams to success through uncharted territories and evolving landscapes. Chapter 9. Building and Sustaining Professional Relationships 
The cornerstone of long-lasting success in any field is the strength of your professional relationships. Whether it's with colleagues, mentors, or industry peers, nurturing these relationships provides a network of support, advice, and opportunities that can propel you and your endeavors forward. The Value of Networking Networking is more than just exchanging business cards or adding contacts on LinkedIn. It's about creating meaningful connections that provide mutual benefits. Your network can offer insights, open doors to new opportunities, and facilitate collaborations that might not have been possible alone. Engage authentically. Authentic engagement is key to building trust and rapport. When networking, focus on how you can help others. Listen to their needs and interests, and find ways to provide value, whether through resources, knowledge, or connections. Stay consistent. Consistency is crucial in maintaining professional relationships. Regular check-ins, updates, and follow-ups keep you relevant within your network. Even a simple message or a brief call can keep the relationship strong and remind others that you value their connection. Leveraging Mentorships Mentors play a pivotal role in personal and professional development. They provide guidance, encourage growth, and offer advice based on their experiences and insights. Choosing the right mentor. Look for mentors who reflect where you aspire to be. They should not only possess the experience and skills you seek to learn, but also share a personal connection with you, ensuring they have a genuine interest in your development. Being a good mentee. Being a mentee is an active role. Come to each meeting prepared with questions and updates on your progress. Show appreciation for your mentor's time and insights and apply what you learn. This demonstrates your commitment to growth and their investment in your success. Cultivating Peer Relationships Relationships with peers are just as important as those with mentors. Peers understand your current challenges and pressures. They are often in the same boat. Collaborate rather than compete. View your peers as collaborators, not competitors. Share resources and knowledge, support each other's successes, and look for ways to work together on projects or initiatives. This approach builds a supportive community around you, enhancing your collective success. Foster reciprocity. Reciprocity is fundamental in any relationship. If someone helps you, find a way to return the favor. This balance builds mutual respect and ensures that the relationship is beneficial for both parties. Effective conflict resolution. Conflicts are inevitable in any relationship, but resolving them effectively is crucial to sustaining them. The ability to handle conflicts constructively can strengthen trust and respect. Communicate openly and respectfully. When conflicts arise, address them directly with the parties involved. Communicate openly about your perspectives and listen to theirs. Approach the conversation with respect and a desire to find a solution, not to win an argument. Seek win-win solutions. Aim for solutions that benefit all parties involved. This not only resolves the current conflict, but also sets a positive precedent for handling future disagreements. Maintaining professional relationships over time. Maintaining relationships requires effort and intention. As careers evolve and life gets busy, it's easy to lose touch with professional contacts. Regular updates. Keep your network informed of your professional developments. Regular updates via emails, newsletters, or social media posts can keep you on their radar. Reconnect periodically. Make an effort to reconnect periodically with contacts you haven't spoken to in a while. A brief message asking about their projects or commenting on their successes can rekindle the relationship. Offer help. Always look for ways to be helpful to your contacts. Offering help not only strengthens your relationships, but also sets a foundation of goodwill that often leads to mutual benefits. Building and sustaining professional relationships is an ongoing process that requires genuine interest consistent effort, and mutual respect. By investing in these relationships, you ensure a foundation of support and opportunity that will serve your career and personal growth for years to come. Chapter 10. Embracing Leadership with Purpose and Passion Leadership is not merely a role or a title. It is an action and an example. A truly impactful leader not only drives success, but also inspires and elevates others to achieve their best. Embracing leadership with purpose and passion is essential for cultivating a fulfilling career 
and a thriving organizational culture. Defining your leadership purpose. Your leadership purpose is the intrinsic driving force that gives your actions direction and meaning. It is what motivates you to lead and shapes how you approach leadership. Discover your why. Start by reflecting on why you want to lead and what kind of leader you want to be. Consider the core values that are most important to you and how they align with your leadership style. This alignment ensures that your actions are not only effective, but also resonate with authenticity. Communicate your vision. A clear vision provides a roadmap for you and your team. It articulates where you are heading and why it matters. Communicate this vision regularly to keep everyone aligned and motivated towards the same goals. Cultivating passion in your team. Passion is contagious. As a leader, one of your key roles is to ignite and maintain passion within your team. This can transform mundane tasks into meaningful parts of a larger purpose. Lead by example. Demonstrate your commitment to your work and your team by being involved and enthusiastic. When your team sees your passion in action, they are more likely to emulate this energy in their own roles. Encourage ownership. Empower your team members by giving them ownership of their projects. This sense of responsibility can enhance their engagement and passion for the work they do. Celebrate milestones. Recognizing and celebrating milestones and achievements, big or small, boosts morale and keeps the team motivated. It shows that you value their hard work and are invested in their success. Fostering an environment of growth and innovation. Innovation is the lifeblood of any thriving organization. As a leader, fostering an environment where new ideas can flourish is crucial for ongoing success. Promote a culture of learning. Encourage continuous learning and professional development. Provide opportunities for training, workshops, and cross-departmental collaboration that stimulate creativity and skill development. Encourage risk-taking. Create a safe space for taking calculated risks. Let your team know that failure is a part of learning and growth, and it should not be feared, but used as a stepping stone to greater achievements. Be open to feedback. Encourage open communication and feedback about processes, decisions, and management. This openness not only helps you improve as a leader, but also enhances the trust and transparency within the team. Navigating challenges with resilience and adaptability. Leadership often involves navigating complex challenges and making tough decisions. Resilience and adaptability are key qualities that help you manage these challenges effectively. Develop emotional resilience. Maintain your focus and composure under pressure by developing emotional resilience. This can be achieved through mindfulness practices, stress management techniques, and a strong support network. Adapt proactively. Be proactive about change. Stay ahead of industry trends and anticipate potential challenges. By adapting early, you can turn potential threats into opportunities and set your team up for success. Resolve conflicts constructively. Handle conflicts wisely and with empathy. Focus on understanding all sides and finding solutions that are agreeable to all involved parties. Effective conflict resolution can strengthen relationships and enhance team cohesion. Embracing leadership with purpose and passion not only drives your own career forward, but also creates a ripple effect of motivation, inspiration, and success across your entire organization. By focusing on purpose-driven leadership and fostering a passionate team environment, you lay the groundwork for sustained achievement and fulfillment. Chapter 11. Achieving Work-Life Harmony Achieving a balance between professional ambitions and personal well-being is crucial for long-term success and fulfillment. Work-life harmony is not about dividing your time equally between work and personal life, but about finding a blend that enables you to thrive both at work and at home. Redefining Work-Life Balance the traditional view of work-life balance often suggests a rigid separation between work and personal life. However, work-life harmony is a more fluid and realistic approach where both areas of life complement each other. Integrate, don't isolate. Consider ways to integrate elements of your personal life into your workday and vice versa. This might mean taking midday breaks for fitness, bringing family to company events, or working from home when needed to participate in family activities. Prioritize flexibility. 
Flexibility is key in achieving harmony. It allows you to adapt to the demands of your personal and professional life without feeling stretched too thin. Work with your employer to establish a flexible work arrangement that suits your life's needs. Setting boundaries for sustainable success. Setting clear boundaries is essential to prevent burnout and maintain productivity. It helps manage expectations of colleagues and family members and protects your personal time. Learn to say no. Saying no is a powerful tool for maintaining boundaries. Be clear about your limits and communicate them respectfully. This helps prevent overcommitment and ensures that you can give your best to each task you undertake. Disconnect to reconnect. Make conscious efforts to disconnect from work during personal time. This might mean turning off work emails or notifications after hours. Such practices help you recharge and return to work with renewed energy and focus. Managing time. Effectively, effective time management is crucial in achieving work-life harmony. It allows you to maximize productivity during work hours, leaving more time for personal activities. Prioritize tasks. Use tools like the Eisenhower box or the Pareto principle, 80-20th rule, to prioritize tasks based on their importance and urgency. This helps you focus on what truly matters, reducing wasted time and effort. Delegate when possible. Delegation is not a sign of weakness, but a strategic tool for effective leadership. By delegating tasks that others can handle, you free up your time for higher priority projects and personal interests. Investing in your well-being. Your personal well-being directly impacts your professional performance. Investing in your physical, mental, and emotional health is essential for maintaining your performance over the long term. Regular exercise. Physical activity is not only good for the body, but also for the mind. It enhances your mood, clears your mind, and boosts energy levels, making you more effective in all areas of life. Mindfulness and meditation practices like mindfulness and meditation can significantly reduce stress and improve concentration. Even a few minutes a day can make a big difference in your overall well-being. Pursue passions and hobbies. Engage in activities outside of work that bring you joy and relaxation. Whether it's painting, hiking, or playing music, hobbies can provide a refreshing counterbalance to your professional life. Nurturing relationships outside of work. Strong personal relationships are crucial for emotional support and happiness. They provide a counterbalance to the pressures of work. Schedule regular family time. Make it a priority to schedule regular time with your family and friends. Whether it's a weekly dinner date or a weekend outing, quality time with loved ones is crucial for maintaining strong relationships. Engage in community activities. Participating in community events can enhance your sense of belonging and provide a broader support network. It also offers a fresh perspective and helps you appreciate a world beyond work. Achieving work-life harmony is an ongoing process that requires continuous adjustment and refinement. By prioritizing flexibility, setting clear boundaries, managing your time effectively, investing in your well-being, and nurturing personal relationships, you create a life that is not only successful, but also deeply satisfying and enriching. Chapter 12. Cultivating Financial Wisdom Financial wisdom is not solely about accumulating wealth, but managing and growing it effectively to ensure long-term security and freedom. Understanding the principles of sound financial management can empower you to make informed decisions that bolster your success and stability. The Fundamentals of Financial Management Effective financial management begins with understanding the basics. Budgeting, saving, investing, and debt management. Each element plays a crucial role in building a secure financial foundation. Budgeting. Your financial blueprint. Budgeting is about knowing where your money goes and planning how to allocate it best. Start by tracking your income and expenses to understand your financial flow. Use this information to make informed decisions about where to cut costs and how to prioritize your spending. Saving. The cornerstone of financial security. Building a robust savings buffer is essential to handle unforeseen expenses and avoid debt. Aim to save at least 20% of your income each month. Consider automating your savings to ensure it happens regularly without your intervention. Investing. Growing your wealth. Investing is key to building wealth over the long term. Educate yourself on different investment options, such as stocks, 
bonds, real estate, or mutual funds, and understand the risks and rewards associated with each. Tailor your investment strategy to match your financial goals and risk tolerance. Debt management. Keeping liabilities in check. Effective debt management involves understanding the difference between good debt, like a mortgage or business loan, and bad debt, like high-interest credit card debt. Strive to minimize high-cost debts and consider strategies such as debt consolidation or refinancing to manage better or reduce interest rates on existing debts. Advanced Financial Strategies Once you have mastered the basics, you can explore more advanced strategies to further enhance your financial stability and growth. Tax Planning Understanding tax implications can help you save money and avoid legal pitfalls. Consult with a tax advisor to make strategic decisions about deductions, tax-efficient investments, and timing of income and purchases. Retirement Planning It's never too early to start planning for retirement. Explore various retirement savings accounts and understand the benefits of each. Maximize contributions to take full advantage of tax benefits and employer matches, if available. Estate Planning Estate planning is crucial for ensuring that your wealth is distributed according to your wishes after you pass away. This involves setting up wills, trusts, and healthcare directives to protect your assets and provide for your loved ones. Financial Literacy and Education Continuously educate yourself about financial markets and trends. This education can help you make more informed decisions and stay adaptive to economic changes. Read financial books and articles. Keep yourself informed by reading widely about finance. Books, reputable financial news sources, and industry reports can provide valuable insights and keep you updated on economic conditions. Attend workshops and seminars. Participate in financial workshops and seminars to deepen your understanding of complex financial concepts and strategies. These events can also provide networking opportunities with financial experts and like-minded individuals. Utilize financial advisors. Consider working with a financial advisor to help manage more complex investment portfolios or financial decisions. A good advisor can provide personalized advice tailored to your specific financial situation and goals. Cultivating a mindset of abundance and prudence. Combine a mindset of abundance, which encourages the pursuit of wealth and success, with financial prudence, which emphasizes careful management and risk assessment. This balanced approach ensures that your financial growth is both ambitious and sustainable. By cultivating financial wisdom, you equip yourself with the tools needed for not just surviving, but thriving financially. This wisdom enables you to manage and grow your resources effectively, ensuring that your financial health supports all areas of your life, allowing you to pursue your passions and achieve your broader life goals without monetary constraints. Chapter 13 Leaving a Lasting Legacy As we approach the final chapter of our exploration into multiplying your success through inner transformation, it's essential to consider the broader impact of your journey, the legacy you leave behind. This legacy isn't just about the wealth or accolades you accumulate, but the influence and inspiration you impart to others. Defining your legacy A legacy is the imprint you leave on the world, the essence of how you will be remembered. It reflects your values, your actions, and the changes you inspire in others. Consider what you want these to be and how you can align your daily actions with this vision. Reflect on your values. Identify the core values that drive you. These values should guide your decisions and actions, ensuring that your legacy is not only about what you achieve, but how you achieve it, through integrity, compassion, innovation, or resilience. Impact through service. Consider how your talents and resources can serve others. Whether it's through mentoring, community service, or leading by example in your professional field, find ways to contribute positively to the lives around you. Building a Legacy in Your Professional Life In your professional life, your legacy can be shaped by the culture you foster, the knowledge you impart, and the standards you set. Mentor and Develop Others One of the most powerful ways to leave a professional legacy is by mentoring and developing future leaders. 
Invest time in sharing your knowledge and skills, offering guidance and supporting others' growth to pave the way for the next generation. Innovate and inspire. Strive to be a source of inspiration and innovation within your field. Challenge the status quo and encourage creative thinking in your team or industry. The changes you initiate can have a lasting impact, defining your legacy as one of transformation and progress. Personal Legacy Relationships and Memories Your personal legacy is often carried forward through the relationships you nurture and the memories you create. Strengthen Family Bonds Invest in your family relationships, as these bonds often form the foundation of your personal legacy. Create traditions, share stories, and impart your values to ensure that these essential aspects of your life are preserved and cherished. Live authentically. Let your true self shine in all aspects of your life. By living authentically, you encourage others to do the same, fostering an environment where genuine connections and personal growth can thrive. Sustaining your legacy. A lasting legacy is sustained by consistently living according to your principles and ensuring that your efforts and achievements are documented and shared. Document your achievements and lessons. Keep a record of your achievements, challenges, and the lessons you've learned. These documents can be invaluable for those who follow in your footsteps, providing insight and inspiration. Plan for Continuity Plan how your work and values will be continued after you are gone. This might involve setting up a foundation, creating scholarships, or ensuring your business practices and ethos are carried on by capable successors. Share your story. Finally, share your story with others, not just as a narrative of success, but as a roadmap of challenges, failures, and triumphs. Your story can guide and inspire others long after you are gone, amplifying the impact of your legacy. In closing, remember that the true measure of your success is not just in the heights you reach, but in the depth and breadth of the positive impact you leave behind. As you continue to grow and succeed, keep your legacy in mind. It is the most enduring aspect of your achievements, resonating through the lives of those you touch. Embrace the responsibility of leaving a lasting legacy with courage and intention and watch as your life's work enriches not only your own path, but also those of generations to come.